this video is titled Taking Apart a Yamaha Wave Venture 700 1998. Um, I'm going to do step by step on how I take this apart. So, in case you took yours apart and don't remember how it goes back together, this will help you. If you are watching this because you're one of my friends, just click, click away, hit the like button. Thank you. Um, this is going to be really boring. No time lapses. Step by step on how I'm taking it together, showing the screws, the sizes, just trying to be helpful to everybody. So please just click away. Thank you. Let's get started. Change of plans. This will sadly be a time lapse video now. Sadly, most of my footage has been ruined, and we are missing a lot of the steps to taking it apart. If you have any questions regarding where something goes, please comment down below. Other than that, enjoy the long time lapse of me taking this apart.
Now we're gonna take this engine, drive shaft probably, that's maybe what you call it, jet pump, and we're going to take it off. We're gonna take it apart, walk you through it a little bit. I'm realizing my content, like if I was an automotive YouTuber, they do way more in each video, but I don't have the money, I don't have the damn time. So I just do a lot of time lapses when I'm here. It's currently like nine o'clock. I was here at 5 a.m. this morning. And I worked all between there. So I'm just making with what I got, you know? But let's take the engine off. I really didn't want to do this. But I realized I have no other choice to get the right size and how I want to do it. I took as much fiberglass off as I could. I just don't want to break anything. But this is the next step. We're going to do it. So let's start disassembling the jet ski motor. The jet pump, the drive, jet drive, the battery, the wiring. And I'm going to film it all. Not just for your sake, but so I remember where the shit goes. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm having way too much fun with this. Ooh. Enjoy. Definitely gonna regret this idea. Oh, it's so damn dusty. Oh, hey, are you having a vacuum? Oh, my God. This, I believe, is the mile an hour sensor. This is to my future self. Jet, pipe, all the way here, all the way to the exhaust. That's how you do it. Don't forget that pipe, Aaron. Don't forget it. All right, so this is the reverse hatch. And the cable is red, red for reverse. Connect this, pull the cable all the way out, and then put that in the thing. These are the two little bolts. This is the thickness of a 10 millimeter wrench. And this is what holds your reverse bucket. I wonder why mine wasn't working. And they're all rusty. Whoa, this goes in water. Who would have thought? Always bag your shit. Uh, uh, did I spell that right? Always bag your stuff, though. Two little nuts, and that's why I film. Honestly, I've been very forgetful. Really, very forgetful recently. So I said, I guess I'll just make YouTube videos and just remember it this way. Slide this puppy in here. Slide that out. Put that in there. Now we have our reverse cable, which seems like it would be a pain in the tuckus to freaking do this inside with everything in there. Next, we are going to take the electric box off. This is like the fuse panel, all the brains. Another note for me, this blue line that goes on the fuel tank neck goes here, but this other blue line is the vent, I believe, or is that the vent, I don't, I don't know, that goes there, I'm sure I'll forget. Instead of having a small shop, 
not small, a cheap shop, I should say. Gotta go to the bathroom. We don't have one. We don't have running water either. So now I gotta go find the nicest gas station to leave the nicest pleasant. <laughs> To the last and final debate engine mounts i had the one ski which was super crusty that i broke them all so i can either take it off from the fiberglass or the cradle i think i'm gonna do the cradle fingers crossed All right, four, 12, 12 millimeter nuts, let's get it. Moment of truth. Video is adjourned. We got the engine out. Um, but yes, thank you for watching. The engine is out. Let's do a little recap before we close the video. At this point, we dissected the Wave Venture. Pieces just everywhere. The engine's out. Now we have the jet drive and the rear end. The next thing we're gonna do is somehow bring the jet boat in here, or we're probably gonna have to do it outside, and just kind of get a rough idea. This is a measure a bajillion times, cut a million times, but just small cuts. Probably gonna take the jet drive out as well so it's lighter, but that is a good stopping point. The engine's out. Everything else is out. Everything's labeled in this bin. We are good to go. Thank you for watching. I have lots of cleaning up to do once again. I won't bore you with it, but the garage is a damn mess, but we're making a ton of progress. We're not killing our budget. We're doing good. So thank you for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, whatever that bullshit. Have a great day.